Hello everyone, Chris with usgalaxyS3.com. I've taken a little break uh, for a number of reasons. One of the biggest reasons is uh, CM10 Jelly Bean coming out for the, the Galaxy S3s. Pretty much, I love Jelly Bean, and once you go Jelly Bean, it's really hard to go back to ICS. Um, but now you get have some of the ROM developers developing ROMs based off of uh, Jelly Bean releases. So you kind of have the choice. Do you want to stay on the, the latest... Uh, release of CM10, the, the nightly releases, or do you want to go for uh, some ROM that someone's uh, manipulated a little and hopefully uh, taken care of uh, some of their the bugs on their own? Um, but this video is about setting up Google Voice with uh, your Verizon uh, phone. Uh, once you get download the app, uh, you can't really set it up automatically to forward your voicemails uh, to Google Voice so that you can read them. Uh, online, uh, listen to them online, and also listen to them through your phone at your own convenience. Of course, this is a form of visual voicemail. You get to pause, rewind, go back, delete, do everything uh, through an application and not have to call a number and just wait. Um, if you don't have data service, you can call your Google Voice number and listen to the voicemails as you would a traditional uh, voicemail service. Uh, it's free. And for Verizon, I'm pretty sure you have to pay if you want visual voicemail. AT&T, uh, last time I had them, you don't. Um, upcoming Galaxy S3 for Cricket, or what we think is coming, uh, should have Cricket's voicemail app in there. I think you have to pay like an extra $150 a month for that. But um, Google Voice also gives you the added benefit of being able to change your, your carrier, change your normal number, and not have to worry because... You can use your Google Voice number for just about everything. So to start forwarding your phone calls when you're busy, when it should go to voicemail, etc., uh, you dial these three codes right here, star 71 plus your voice number, just like you were going to make a phone call, uh, star 90 plus your Google Voice, and star 92 plus your Google Voice number, and all of your phone calls will be uh, forwarded uh, as if... All your phone calls, if you're not able to answer, will be forwarded to your Google Voice number. Uh, let's go over here to uh, Verizon's site where it documents how to end this. To turn off call forwarding, you dial star 73. Uh, press send, wait for the confirmation, beep some message. Pretty much when you're dialing these codes, just let them play out. They'll probably hang up on their own uh, after they're done. You want to ensure busy transfer is back off if you want to disable it. So star 900, uh, send, and then... To ensure no trans uh, answer transfer call forwarding is off, dial star 920 and then uh, send. Now, note that when you're forwarding uh, these calls, you are using your minutes. So if you have an unlimited minute plan, you're good. But if not, you will be using these minutes. So normally a, a voicemail message is like 30 to 45 seconds long. But if someone forgets that they're on voicemail and just keeps on letting that go, you're probably going to get a, uh, a large minute balance charge. So, but if you have unlimited, of course, you're pretty good. Um, let's continue. You can also do this online. And it kind of takes the guesswork out of everything. So sign on to your Verizon Wireless account. Go to My Verizon and then My Device. Go View All. It'll bring you into a screen like this and then you'll hit Call Forwarding and then you'll go to this screen. So choose your mobile number uh, here are your options. Forward all calls. You don't really want to do that because you won't be able to answer the call. So just forward the calls when the line is busy and there's no answer. And do it when it's busy and there is no answer. And select your number. And go ahead and activate the call forwarding. You can come back here and cancel it at any time. So you will start to see me do a lot more videos on this US Galaxy S3 channel. And especially when Cricket gets their S3, if they do, we pretty much think they are. Uh, I'll be doing more videos as well. So please like these videos. It helps me out. Pays for these devices that I have to buy. Uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks a lot.